Hi everyone, today is Sunday so we are going to do our learn how to play guitar solo weekly challenge. In this video, we are going to use the A minor chord tones and the D chord tones that we have learned last week. We're going to use those chord tones to play guitar solo against a backing track. So without further ado, let's get into it. First, I'm going to set example on how to use those chord tones in a backing track. Then afterwards, I'm going to play a solo and you have to copy what I'm doing. And let's just do it for a couple of times. And then I will give you another example after afterwards. Anyway, I'm, I will be giving you a link. That's a link from our guitar exercises and you have to do it every day before doing this uh, lessons about how to play guitar solo. So please do those exercises regularly for you to be able to, you know, cope up uh, if I try to increase the challenge that I'm that we're doing every week. Repeat it. Then move to the second string. D. A minor. D. Third string. Then what we're going to do now is to reverse the process. So we're going to start to play D chord tones. But of course, make sure that the backing track is in D. In the next exercise, we're going to add one note before going to the next chord tone. So we choose two chord tones of A minor, then we go to the D chord tone. Okay, I hope you, have, you got the idea, but, but what we're trying to do here is to literally, you know, if the chord changes to D, you have to play the D chord tone. And uh, if the backing track goes to A minor, you have to play the A minor chord tones. So now what we're going to do is to repeat the notes from a chord tones and the, the D chord tones. We just go. We're just going to play one note at a time, but we're going to play them twice. A minor, D, 
A minor D Okay, I hope you got the idea and this time we're going to play D chord tones twice. Okay, that will be all for this week, but you know, I have to recommend to you that every Saturday I'm doing, I'm also doing uh, lessons about pentatonic scale and in the future we are going to use those lessons for you to be able to play your guitar solo fluently. So if you have time, Again, I uh, would like to recommend you to visit that link. Yes, that link. You can click that and uh, try to visit those videos that I've made every Saturday.